Deputies took the boy here to the Montgomery County Juvenile Detention Center and they say they're still looking for one of his friends. Now at a time when arson is such a big problem, deputies say that this just proves that anyone can be a fire starter. Young wrists in handcuffs. A Montgomery County Sheriff's deputy leads a 12-year-old boy to the back of his cruiser. The arrest comes as Harrison Township firefighters battle a blaze inside an abandoned mobile home in the 3900 block of North Trail. The neighbors are the ones who really play a, a big uh, key in this because they were observant. They noticed the smoke right away. They called 911 as soon as they smelled the smoke. Neighbors say the boys have been a source of trouble in the trailer park. And Wednesday night, one of them says they saw two boys going into the abandoned home. 10 or 15 minutes later, they come out and they kept looking back like they was waiting for something to happen. And they, and then when they left, like five minutes later, I seen black smoke coming out the trailer. Now deputies say the boys had been up to no good all night. They're also accused of setting this fire just a few hours earlier. A vacant home burned less than a mile away at Woodland Hills Boulevard and Shearer Avenue. The structure's been abandoned for about two years. The uh, back door was padlocked, looked like it was forced open. I blame parents for most of the trouble because they're not, they don't even know where their kids are half the time. If somebody gets hurt, you can't go back and, you know, it's not like a video game. You can't start over, you can't make it better. It's not clear right now what charges will be filed in this case, but deputies say the arrest itself sends a message that they will not tolerate arson, no matter who you are. Reporting live in downtown Dayton, I'm Holly Samuels, 2 News on your side.